when I was sitting down watching uh, the television, I heard my son as leaving from one uh, room from the other with the police officers say, I didn't do it, I didn't do it. So I heard him say, I didn't do it. And I was asked the question when I was allowed to see him in jail afterward, did I ask my son if he did it? Well, I have definite feelings about that. I would not insult my son and ask him if he did it. Because I heard him in his own voice say many a time on the television, I did not do it, I did not do it. So I am assuming that he is innocent until proven guilty. That is our American way of life. You said something uh, to the effect the FBI should have kept a watch on your son while the president was visiting Dallas. Were you imputing any guilt on his part by that statement? No. Uh, I say, the day before, I think, I, I watched on television and on read in the paper where, of course, uh, all of the agents were in Dallas protecting, uh, uh, preparing the visit of President Kennedy's security. And so I will say, since my son had defected to Russia, he should have been under surveillance. And had he been under surveillance for the president's uh, uh, journey to Dallas, then President Kennedy would be alive today, and so would my son. And that is, in, uh, that is security protection. He is a known, I hate to use the word, but I will use it, character. And all known characters were being screened and would be under surveillance while President Kennedy was making his uh, tour of Dallas. So then why wasn't Lee Harvey Oswald a known defector not under surveillance? Uh, he se always seemed to know things. Just, For instance, any quiz programs on television, he could immediately give you the answers any uh, uh, things of any significance that another child would not be interested in, he was interested in, and could, uh, well, what I'm trying to say, if uh, somebody was going to fly from one place to the other, he could almost give you the mileage, and things of that sort. He just seemed to know all of these things, and, and they appealed to him, history, and uh, everything of we consider in our society of the finest reading there is. And uh, he read uh, things far beyond his years, but understood them. Uh, and yet, I say, he played as when we own our home. He played with the children in the neighborhood and, and played football at school and ran around. But then he always had time for him, to him in these important things that he wanted to know about. But the main thing was the uh, uh, quiz programs and things that he knew these answers used to amaze me how he knew the correct answer. Do you recall any examples of advanced reading or materials? What materials was he reading? Uh, well, he liked to read Vincent Peale. It's awfully hard for me to remember. Hemingway. Uh, Lee, uh, I, I will give it a go in that category, and but I will put it this way. Uh, we never, uh, the boys, myself and Lee, uh, never read detective stories uh, or uh, Pocket, not that they're not the things to read, I'm not implying that, but uh, Lee never read trashy things. Well, I don't know how else to say it. Had Lee, in his readings of history, ever expressed to you the feeling that he had a special role in life? No. Now, there again, and it may seem odd, uh, Lee did not discuss any of this his feelings about, because I'm his mother, I'm a working mother. You see, uh, uh, things are different under different environment and circumstances. I am not a mother that the children come home to that has the uh, money and, and uh, the mothers come home. When these children come home, I am working. I have the support of these children. So I'm not the type of mother that has the, the time, the daytime to be with the children. When these boys come home at 3 o'clock from school, their mother's not at home. So when I come home from work approximately 6 or 6.30, I have to cook and feed the children. And, 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 and so there's very little time for uh, conversation. Not that we weren't a happy family. We watched television and had our little things. But no, uh, 
intimate discussion, and like you asked me that Lee would uh, talk to me about the history and things. I was too busy a mother supporting my children. 